We are back with episode five of our No Money Spent series. So in the past, what we've been doing is doing some gameplay for you guys, kind of showing you guys what I've been doing, which I'm still going to do. But we're going to change this one up a little bit for you guys. I'm actually only one win away from getting the event reward. So we'll go ahead and hop into that. I have some moments I need to do as well and just kind of go over some of the stuff we've been doing. But the first thing we're going to do, I finally got the last card I need to complete the Anno Collection. Let's go ahead and go grab this card right here. So for you guys that might not know me, and maybe you do know me, maybe you don't, I don't know for sure, but Roberto Clemente is my favorite player of all time. I grew up loving him. My dad idolized him when he was a kid and when he was growing up as well. So I love Roberto Clemente. He's my favorite player of all time. And finally, I get Fernando Tatis to finish off the Padres collection. We're going to go ahead and select them all right there. We get a nice Tony Gwynn card, but we don't care about him right now. We get the Padres done. Now let's head over to the NL West, which we do get Kenley Jansen as well. Another addition to our no money spent team, man. We've been absolutely killing this live series collection. It's been freaking awesome. Got that. We're going to add Kenley to the bullpen as well. But the big one that we're about to do right here. So we finally got Chase Elliott, Kenley Jansen, and Prince Fielder. And we're going to collect him here for my favorite player of all time, Roberto Clemente. This is actually his 3,000 career hit milestone card. So he does have 125 across the board for his contact his power is above 80 which we freaking love his fielding's amazing he's got 72 speed like i say he's my favorite player of all time let's go ahead and collect these guys go ahead and grab roberto so excited to have him on the team a great addition let's go over our actual squad now so obviously roberto's gonna go to right for us let's go ahead and add in kenley jansen i'm probably gonna take out Ottavino. Ottavino has not been very good for me personally so we'll go ahead and throw in kenley jansen here and just for my ocd if you guys know me or if, if you uh if you if you don't uh we have these guys all out of order and that literally drives me absolutely nuts right here so we're gonna go ahead and just add these guys right here make them all look pretty right there and there we have it our bullpen we've got our starting rotation which we did pick up uh jacob de grom as well so finally got him the rotation is looking nice. Our starting lineup is looking nice. I'm going to look at here and see if we can add anybody else in there. We do have Fernando we can use off the bench as well. I went ahead and bought Trey Turner as well. So look at now we have Kirk Gibson over here in left field as well. But what I want to do right here is kind of do like a little mini debut, I guess, for Bruno Clemente as well and Kirk Gibson right here too. Let's go ahead and add them in the lineup for our event team. And let's see if we get some moonshots with these guys. Okay, so we have our team set up. Let's go ahead and see what we can do for our final event when all we need is one more to get this Tim Salmon. I might do a little bit more here too just to go ahead and grab some of those packs because I haven't done a lot of those yet either. And those big dog packs can go for a little bit. You can get some nice cards out of that too. So maybe we go a little bit further on this. I think we only have like one more day, one or two more days for this. So uh, let's see what we can do. We're going to go ahead and throw uh, Chi Chi Gonzalez right here. Again, first time using Roberto Clemente and Kirk Gibson on the No Money Spent series. So excited to give them a shot. Let's see what we can do. Hopefully, it's not too much of a sweaty one. All right, he's throwing. Okay, not really a crazy squad right here, to be honest. Pretty laid back squad here. Nothing too, nothing too bad. Let's go crazy. Got that new Seiya Suzuki. One over there. Let's see if Mike Chalk can grab that for us, please. There we go. I see the last out here. Good pitch. We get out of it. Let's go hit some bombs this moonshot event. Oh, let's get down. Okay. Let's go, Jazz. 94 speed, too. Should we get a second? Beautiful. Okay, here's Roberto Clemente's first at bat here, man. I am excited. I am now very sad. Very sad and less excited. That stinks. Oh, that ball's peace. That a boy. Can we get home there? I'm going to stay. I'm going to stay right there. We got Mike Trout up next, too. It's a moonshot event. Let's get a home run with Mike Trout here. Mikey! Do we get a rage quit? Do we get a rage quit? Could, possibly. Not yet, at least. Mike Trout, like I said, we're going to home run with him. No rage quit? Okay, good. All right, good. Oh, gosh. My first shot bats my new players on the team. Of course we miss him. Of course. Oh, Gary. Dude, Gary Carter. I don't know what it is, man. This card is so good for me. I don't know why I swung at that. I have no idea. Why do, what is his second baseman doing right there? I don't know what is going on right now. Spencer Torkelson. Dude, 
This Torgerson card is mm, mwah, the chef's kiss. He is amazing. We should score two more off of that. We are up five to zero. See if he still stays in here. Juan Soto, go, please. All right, it's not enough for a home run. It's another double, though, and we're up 6-0. I'm about to say, my man is literally just leaving this, this pitcher out here to dry. We killed that ball a little bit on top, but we got a six spot, though. Oh, gosh, that ball was pieced. I think Roberto might get to that one, actually. Yep, throw it in, Roberto. Come on, bud. Look at that cannon arm from there. Oh, Roberto, Roberto. This is why we have Roberto. That is exactly why I have Roberto out there. That diamond defense is beautiful. I should have known, man. I should have known in the moonshot event that throwing a ball above his head would probably get hit for a home run. I should have known that. Should have known that. Good. Beautiful. That a boy. Roberto. That's going to get down, right? Okay, it's going to get down. It's going to get down. That PCI was horrendous, but it's Roberto's first hit on the account. We love it, man. Kirk. Get going, baby. Oh, we're definitely going home there. 100% going home there. Oh, we actually threw it to third. Okay. Did not think they were going to do that. Corey. We're going to roll over there. Okay. We're up eight to three. We got five runs to play with. Let's close thing down and get our Tim Salmon. <laughs> Wait. Okay. I'm about to say, is that a fair ball? Well, that'd be a fair ball on me. Thank you. We'll take the out right there. Beautiful. Okay, should be our second out. Let's get one more out. Oh, throw to the tech first. <laughs> well, I guess that's a way to uh, win the game. We had runners on first and second, nobody out. And then that happens. I'm cool with it. We get our 15th win right there, which means we get Tim Salmon. Pop up for me. We get Tim Salmon right there. And Tim Salmon, actually, looking at his card, is not that horrible. Actually, hitting attribute-wise, let's get him pulled up super, super quick. So here's Tim Salmon right here. He's only going for 12K. His hitting attributes are actually pretty decent. You can use him 100% off your bench for a guy against a lefty. He can pretty be decent against righties, too, honestly. His fielding, a little sketchy, though. 60 fielding, we don't love that. And 55 speed, that's not going to help him out. I would probably not put him out in your outfield, but that is up to you if you want to. But we finally finished off the event grind. Now that we got our event reward, let's go ahead. We're going to move over a little bit to our showdown. We're going to do our showdown here. I have not done the cover athlete one for you guys yet. It looks like it should be super simple. I'm not really thinking it's going to be too hard. So I'm going to go ahead and draft a team right here. We're going to get some good perks, and I can show you guys that right when I'm done. Okay, so here's the squad we're going to rock with. I'm pretty sure somebody told me that we face Shohei Otani every single time in the showdowns, in the boss battles. I'm pretty sure. Maybe not. I don't know. We're going to find out together. But this is the, the lineup we're going to go with right here. Pretty good lineup. Nothing too crazy right there. The perks we're rocking with, you guys, always want to go with Hero Time. Hero Time is one of the best perks. It is literally always activated for you guys in all these moments. Clear for takeoffs, another good one too. There's a lot of really good perks you guys should be doing. I'm gonna go ahead and run through these moments and I'll meet you guys in the final boss. No, he stays. Hands on your body. I don't wanna waste your time. Okay, so we are finally to the final boss here. So what we're gonna do, knowing that Shohei Otani is our final boss, we're gonna go ahead and put in every lefty imaginable that we can because we want to make sure we're facing him with a bunch of lefties. So it doesn't matter by position either because guess what? Anybody can play in this, so that is totally fine. Let's get Kyle Schwarber in here. We'll put him at third for right now. We do have Baez there. There's only righty, which is I think I'm going to be fine with that. Emma Kutch in here too. We're just going to throw in every left that we can. Like I said, all these lefties are going to be right here. Hopefully we'll be able to get this done pretty quickly. It shouldn't take too long here. I want to go ahead and show you guys our perks we're going to use here too. So that way you guys take a look at it. We have hero time. I'm going to go ahead and put in heart attack as well. That way these are kind of always working for us while we are actually going in the showdown. Heart attack, rally time, and hero time are the best that you guys be using. So unfortunately I did miss one 
against uh, one of the moments. I didn't know home run. I think it was in Safeco or whatever. So we did not tie it up, but we still have 12 outs to get three runs. So should be pretty manageable. Hopefully, we have all lefties up besides hybrid bias. So we should be good here. All right, Bryce Harper leads us off with a double. It's exactly what I want to do right there. We're trying to avoid the double plays because you guys know double plays are an absolute plague right now in this game, and I hit into them a lot. Joe! Got to go, got to go, got to go, got to go, got to go. Yes, let's go. Okay, runners on second and third. If we hit home run right here, we're done with this entire show. Now let's go. Let's go, Big Poppy. Okay. Here we go. We have tied the game. We do have Big Poppy on first base, so we don't love that. And we hit into a double play. I'm going to cry. Let's finish out with Schwarber here. I'm going to cry. I am going to cry. Joey! Thank you. We finished the cover athlete showdown. Thank you. That actually took, I'm not going to lie, it took a little bit longer than I thought it was going to take. I think all in all, that was a little bit over half an hour. Not as long as we want it to be, but we did finally finish that off. Thank goodness we are, I think it gets you 25 of those points. I think they call them for the uh, reward path. Let's go over here really quick just to see where we're at now. The other programs, let's go to cover athletes program. Yeah, so you get 25 stars for that. I haven't done any of these moments, so I was going to say, we were going to go over these moments, but... That actually will make this video like super long. I don't really want to worry about that right now. I do have some of this stuff done too right here. But so we're not going to go over the moments. I do need to finish off the cover athletes program. Um, their moments. I need to do the April monthly award moments too. And I got to finish off the Washington and uh, Houston City Connect jersey ones too. I got to add in Michael Branley and Anthony Rendon into a lineup and just get the stats done with those guys. So um that will be it for our episode five of No Money Spent. I'm going to try to do a little bit more grinding stuff for you guys. I know a lot of people have been asking about that, so I kind of make this a little bit more of a grinding one for you guys. We will be doing some more debuts too, so don't worry about that. We'll, we'll keep making those uh, as we go along as well. But thank you guys, man. You guys have been awesome on this series. Hopefully, it's helping you guys out. Hopefully, me running through it has helped you guys kind of go through it as well. So I appreciate you guys. Again, make sure you guys always hit that like button for me to beat that algorithm. Make sure you guys comment down below what you guys think about this No Money Spent series. And make sure you subscribe, turn on all notifications. That way, you guys never miss a video. But until next time, I will see you guys. Peace. No, he says Hands on your body. I don't want to waste your time.